In a cemetery in Somme, France, 719 soldiers from many different nations lay to rest underneath American soil, their names engraved into white stone crosses. Staff Sergeant Eric Ellingson is here today to pay his respects to a man he never knew. On behalf of my family, uh, I represent them in honoring the memory of Knut Ellingson, my father's uncle who served in World War I and uh, died at the Battle of Kintinji on the second day of the offense. You can see it on the faces of the veterans, on the eyes of the general who commands the division, on the hearts of every man and woman in uniform. It's not an emotion or an ideal. It's an action known as honor. To me, honor and respect, and I, and I, and I take it to a level probably much higher than we can ever, ever think, but it means to, to really stop and think about and thank those who have made a sacrifice in behalf of a grateful nation to say to our war dead and those who are currently serving, we won't forget you, we honor your service, and we honor your sacrifice. Honor is a selfless act. It is a concept that reaches far beyond standard military traditions and courtesies. Honor is essential to our survival. By honoring the past, we protect our future. 719 names, 21 guns, one flag in remembrance of the unforgotten. Specialist Cody Wilson, Somme, France. That's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television, Washington.